Good morning, everyone. How you guys doing? Happy onesie Wednesday, everyone. I hope everyone's having a great day. I got this little one dressed. George just ran in here. You got Bay. Bay, say hey, everybody. What? Come on, come say hi. Good job. <laughs> So I got toy dress for onesie Wednesday, you guys. She's sitting on the box. So, so she has on this cute little floral onesie. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> so it's gray, and then it has all these pretty little flowers on it, like pink and purple. It is so, so cute. And the thighs out, TT. Yes. And um, she doesn't have any socks on. I haven't been putting her on socks for the summer. So she's really enjoying it, you guys. I love this baby. <laughs> um, I haven't made videos in a couple days. You gonna sit down? Hmm? I haven't made videos in a couple days. So I wanted to let you guys know what's going on in Reborn Love is Real Land. Uh, first, we started potty training again and it's going fantastic. Wait a minute. <laughs> It's going fantastic. Um, Labor Day was the very first day. Uh, we got pee-pee in the potty, and we were so excited. Hubby, Daddy was dancing. I was dancing. When Joy finally finished, she was dancing. It was We were singing. It was thrilling. <laughs> so we were so excited um, about potty training. Um, what else? Put in a nursery in my bedroom. So I really want to do it. But where I would do it would be right here in this very spot where I'm sitting. So this is where I also do my talking videos. Um, even though I don't do many talking videos, I still want to have the space available. So I'm not sure how that would work out. She's seen the ceiling fan, you guys. Lord have mercy. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you see Toy? You see Toy? Yeah. I don't know how that would work out. Um, hubby Daddy said that if I need to put toy on his side of the bed, it's okay. I said, well, if I put toy on your side of the bed, it would be the nursery on that side of the bed, and I would also have Jay and Sky. He said, well, toy can be on my side of the bed, so <laughs> just toy. <laughs> He's so partial to her. So I'm still trying to work out the logistics about how I want to put the nursery in the bed. If I I really want the nine cube system because I like how everything's separated and organized. I really, really like that. Um, I could do it in my dresser as well, but I would just have to rearrange my furniture because since Joy is potty training, she doesn't really need that dresser anymore for a changing table. And it's bulky and she's gonna get her toddler bed. We already have our toddler bed. Um, just gotta get a mattress. And just waiting for her to finish potty training. So, yeah, it's about to be toddler time. So, um, that's something. Um, painting. Um, I watch Pooh Bear 253 Holanda Holbert. I love her channel. And she's painting. And she is doing an excellent, excellent job. So, it has inspired me to try painting one more time. So, I have to strip the paint and then do it again so that's going to be a project i'm going to try i should have did it over the weekend while hubby daddy was home hmm. but it was family time so we spent time together so um i need to do that um i want to reweigh the girls so um i want to send a shout out to beloved little angels nursery thank you sis for telling me about the poly pellets i already have poly pellets but i want something heavier than poly pellets so i went and got some sand from dollar tree i bought four bags of sand so I think it's a little heavier than the poly pellet, so I'm going to try that. I'm going to try it in Sky first and see how that goes. If it works out, then I'll go get some more sand for toy. If not, I'm only out $4, and I'm okay with that. I also told you guys that I was looking at a little mini 9-inch baby, and I love that kit. Um, it's an open eye baby, so I would do want another open eye baby. Um, but it's 9 inches, so I really... Not sure about the cuddle factor. Um, I may need to ask somebody with a nine inch baby how they interact with that baby, or is it just a cute little baby to look at? Because Ambrosia's dollhouse has a little nine inch baby. Skylar North, oh my goodness, I love that baby. That's what made me really 
think about mini babies because I wasn't really into them before, but that baby is too cute. And she dresses that baby very, very cute. Um, she gets her clothes from Wooby Baby. So I looked at their website. They're um, closed right now because they moved, but um, some comparable stores like that on Etsy, their clothes could range anywhere from $15 to $30 for an outfit. And so it'll be a onesie, um, um, pants, footed pants, a hat, and some booties. So I think it's a good deal. It's just a little pricey for me for $15 for one outfit where I'm used to, you know, going to the thrift store and getting stuff for 55 cents. <laughs> So, um, it would take up a lot of my reborn budget since now I have a budget for the babies. So, that's just something to think about. Raja just walked in and lay down. Um, I was also looking for a bigger kit, a bigger open-eyed kit, like a six-month or a nine-month baby. Because I want a boy, and I think it'll be cute to dress them and interact with them, especially since now that, um... I introduced Sports Sunday, and thank you guys so, so much for embracing that theme. I really, really appreciate it, you guys. That has been so heartwarming for me. Um, what else? I was on Instagram the other day just scrolling through, saying I love the baby pictures, and someone posted a pic saying that they just um, came from a meetup or were at a meetup in my area. And I was like, what? So I actually... Um, um, private message them, direct message them, hoping I, hoping I can get some information about the meetup and maybe I can attend the next one that they have. So I'm really excited about that. I hope, hope, hope they um, contact me back because I really want to be a part of that. That is something that I wanted to experience, a Dolly meetup. Um, because I know I get to see the babies here on YouTube, but to actually interact with the babies and meet the moms in person and hold the babies and look at them, I think that'll be really, really awesome. So that is something that I want to do. Oh, while I have Joy here, Joy, <laughs> while I have Toy here, I wanted to show you guys how I hold her. So the um, preemie babies are really, really tiny, little bitty things. So, <laughs> um Toy is like a two-month or three-month-old baby, and I don't really cradle her like this unless she's eating. So when I'm just holding her, walking around the house, I hold her on my shoulder. Yeah. And I just pat her back, and we just walk around. That's what I do. That's how I hold this one, you guys. I love this baby. Oh, she don't like it sometimes. Uh... Was she on the verge of being sleepy? So she's kind of right, fighting with me right now. She likes to sit down and see herself in the camera. <laughs> there you are. Yeah. Huh? It's okay. There, you can sit back on the boppy. Okay. Okay, so that's how I hold this little one. See, she has good control over her neck. She can sit up in the boppy, you know, by herself. So, yeah. My big girl. <laughs> what else is going on, you guys? Mm, I think that's it. Um, I talked about painting. And I talked about the big baby. I talked about the mini baby. I talked about potty training. And the nursery coming in the room. I think that's about it, you guys. Yeah. Um, I got some new subscribers. I am so excited. <laughs> yeah we're so excited we got some new subscribers thank you guys so so much for watching if there's anything in particular you want to see or any questions you want to ask please feel free to comment and let me know um the only video that i don't think i'll be able to do immediately would be a day in the life now i did say that i wanted to do a day in the life by the end of the year but i don't really have the logistics in mind for that. All I can see right now is me putting the tripod in my stairwell and y'all watching me go up and down the stairs because I go up and down the stairs about 50 times a day. Yeah, um, because the kitchen is downstairs and we're mostly upstairs. So I go up and down the stairs a lot. When we first moved here, I was five months pregnant and 
I was like, we're going to have to move. <laughs> I cannot see me going up and down these stairs with a baby. But um, like I said, we stay upstairs most of the time. We go downstairs to eat. That's about it. Or I'll go downstairs and get something and bring it back up here. Yeah, that's about how that goes. So I will put forth a valiant effort and try to come up with the logistics for a day in the life, you guys, because my day in my life includes joy and my fur babies. <laughs> so that'll all be included in that as well as all three of the babies. So, well, maybe not all three. We'll see how that goes. I'm going to work on it, you guys. I'm really going to. What are you doing? Oh, my goodness. She's going to fall out the poppy. <laughs> this is not a slide. She is so funny. Here. Okay. You're going to sit on mama's lap because you're doing too much with the poppy. There you go. Here. Mommy going to hold you. You can still see yourself. There you go. There you go. You can still see yourself in the camera. Oh, my goodness. This little one here. As you can see, she can't be a handful. I don't know if I want to. That's another six month over here. There you go. She likes that. There you go. <laughs> so enjoy. <laughs> okay, you guys. I hope you have a wonderful Wednesday Wednesday. Have a great day, you guys. Can you say it again? Bye.